I'm Jaden Goth, and this is week six. This week in audio two, we learned about audio connectors. We learned about XLR cables, TRS cables, and RCA. And XLR cable seems to be the choice for live sound. It seems that we're learning the full scope of audio. This week seems to be all about live sound. Some fun facts I took away from this week in levels of practice um, in audio class is that analog is voltage and digital is electric. Learns about headroom and a transient. It's basically a transient is when you pluck stepping strings, a string on a guitar. It's the first sound that comes out and then it fades away. And headroom is like a safety zone for like allowing transient audio peaks to exceed the nominal level without damaging the system. It's between I think distortion and noise floor. In Dig Audio, we learned about hardware and it's basically what components affect a door performance and what components don't affect a door performance. Like for instance, um, factors that don't really affect a door performance would be like the keyboard, the graphics card and so forth, but like Factors that um, do affect the door performance would be the CPU, the motherboard and the RAM. In IT we learned about software and it was about device drivers, BIOS and firmware and also we went on to the different types of licensing. Nick. So yeah like commercial licensing, um, shareware licensing, so yeah. In lesson two we also learned more about software but it was um, how app stores are popular in a way. So like by their streaming, their safety, security wise, um, redundancy, and yeah. In Digdoor, we learned about how to make a Pro Tools Mix window come up. So just the steps in order for us to see and the different faders and the masters and stuff. But wait, there was a pop quiz. It did catch me by surprise, but I knew my stuff, so it was calm. Finally, in business this week, we learned about the different copyrights comprising a song. The two main ones were composition and publishing. We learned about music copyrights, literary copyrights, and master copyrights. Know your rights, people. Know your rights. The coolest little trick I learned in business this week about copyright is that you need to mail it to yourself. Say, for instance, you're working on a song. You need to first date it, sign it, name it. Then you're gonna seal it in an envelope, go to the post office, and then mail it to yourself. Mail it to yourself. So, and obviously don't open the envelope. Week seven is coming up and we're almost done. But it's cool because I'm so psyched for module two.